This morning, Fayette County educators, administrators, and supporters gathered in the Lexington Center downtown as Superintendent Manny Kalk gave his annual State of Schools address. Claire Kopsky was there as among the things Kalk addressed were teacher shortages and security. The first day is just around the corner and Fayette County has their goals set. Making sure that for every child, in every classroom and every school is working up to their full potential. During his state of schools address, the superintendent spoke about the national teacher shortage, saying Fayette County Public Schools are a destination for many Kentucky teachers. We're not as, in, or as impacted by those shortages as maybe other communities are, so we're blessed in that sense but we know we're going to continue to do more to make sure that we attract the very best. He detailed that there are less than 20 positions left to fill for the fall, and those positions already have offer letters sent out. Given the country climate on safety and shootings, as well as the recent conviction of a former Dunbar student for terroristic school threats, the superintendent says they have been using a 10-point plan to address the root of the problem. This past year, we hired uh, 58, we have a total of 58 law enforcement officers, we have four time nurses in our middle school, I'm sorry, in our high schools and looking to expand that down. We also have added um, more mental health professionals. So as we begin this upcoming school year, that ratio now is 300 students to one mental health professional. The words of uh, my, my student really encapsulates what this is about hardening the school, um, hardening the building and softening the school. Another highlight involves bus drivers. He said Fayette County is fully staffed for every bus route for the first time in a decade. In addition, the superintendent says the district supports Senate Bill 1, the School Safety and Resiliency Act. Although our community has taken steps, bold steps to make sure that our children are safe and those that care for them are safe, we want to make sure that children across the Commonwealth are safe as well. In Lexington, Claire Kopsky, LEX 18 News.